Here we are again. Mm -hmm. uh, hallelujah. With Noam Corral Gilad. So Noam, I'm ready when you are. Thank you very much. So, hello to everybody. Um, we're still in uh, Pesach. This period, it's very long. The Passover. <laughs> the Passover. April 9th. Yes, it's April 9th. And I don't have a kind, I don't have any kind of idea what is going to come. So we will let it come. Okay. do the invoke of the most high God and goddess the infinity light the one God Jehovah and the Shekhinah all the others the Elohim Lord, the Heaven Lord, the Malkit Sedek Order. I invite also all the Masters and all of the armies, arms, arm, armies of the angels. And all of the family that comes every time to be with us, to support us in this process. I, uh, hey, uh, the I feel very strong energy. that comes to me right now. I, uh, he. I invite also all of humanity oh, yeah. from the moment it begins to exist until those days. But of course only the ones who choose to come and to arrive and to take a part. And we are going to go today to a travel. From, I still, the, hmm? from the beginning of humanity to today all those who want to come and we are going to go to a travel i still do not know where to but they show me so we will start to do it first of all we have to do um, excuse me it's hot for me to speak uh, yeah. because this energy I ask to expand the borders of my bodies and my ability to contain those energies Okay, we will start in a grounding process. I invite everyone to sit comfortably now and to connect to the most high resources of love and light for every one of us. Everyone to those sources that he feels or she feels connected to. 
and we start to inhale qualities of love, of light, of balance, of healing, and also of strength. And we inhale until a specific point and exhale from those specific points to all of our bodies and to our soul. And then gradually, with every breath, we enter deeper and deeper into ourselves, also to a place which is much more calmer and much more connected to our center. And at the same time, we just take all those qualities from above, enter it into our bodies, into our tube, main tube. And when we exhale, we spread all those qualities and energies to all of our subtle bodies and to our soul at the same time. So we start like with the crown chakra with the first breath and then on the exhale we spread it out to all of our subtle bodies uh, and then we go down a different level let's say to the pineal gland in the it, middle it, of the brain or to the throat chakra we do not we do not have to limit it it's not true okay not to uh, any gland or to any chakra because everyone has his own ability to breathe until place he can do it okay. so this is the reason they give it much more fluently which means that everyone can do it and may do it until the place he feels it's proper for him or okay. her so it can be here it, be, it can be in the penal gland it can be the third eye can it can be the th the thymus gland it can be the heart but then, then then you go lower you go lower until you get to the feet? Yes, but I, I still didn't Stop. say it all. Okay. It's very gradually. We inhale, for example, as Eliyahu say, said, for example, to the throat, and we exhale to all of our subtle bodies that it fulfills all our subtle bodies and soul until the aura of the throat. And then we inhale deeper. For example, to the to the lungs. To the lungs. Zenica lungs throat. Yes. Okay. To the lungs, for example. And then we exhale it to all of our subtle bodies and soul. And exactly we continue like this gradually until we, go we down, arrive. Yes, down. More and more. More and more until we arrive to our feet. 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 Okay. Okay. We will do it now. Okay. And when we arrive to our feet, we continue to inhale those qualities from above, but this time we attune them to our feet and we imagine that our legs and feet becomes more and more deeper into the ground, under the surface of the ground, into the magma, into the seed of earth, and in the, the core, middle of the, the, core, the of core, and in the middle of the core of earth, there is the heart of Mother Earth. So with every breath, when we inhale the energy, as we exhale the energy, every time it becomes deeper and deeper in the ground. But also here it's very gradually. And when we arrive to the heart of Mother Earth, we anchor our feet and the qualities of the energy that we inhale from above to the heart of Mother Earth. And we will give time now to do this process.
to the core or if to be much more um, exact to the heart of Mother Earth that in the middle of this core of Earth after we anchored those energy and our feet gradually we pay our attention to the specific energy of Mother Earth which is a little more uh, um, dense uh, dense away כן, יותר סמיך, התכוונתי, כמו דייסה. It's a thicker energy. Yes, it's... Also warmer, yes? Yes, it's a warm energy, warmer energy, soft, very soft, and very covering, and very nurturing. And now we just start to inhale those qualities from Mother Earth when we attune ourselves. to a specific quality that we want to observe into us. Like which are? Hmm? Yes, which are? Security. Okay. <laughs> I try to chase after you, All but right. I have to be connected to here. Okay, so. yes, yes. which are, first of all, grounding, base, root. What? Roots. Roots. And also, security, safeness, stability, presence, And if we want also support and nutrition. And we inhale the energy through our feet until a specific point and then we spread it with the exhale to our subtle bodies and to our soul and in every breath we inhale a little more higher in our energetic legs and spread it until this point we do it very gradually until we arrive to the crown chakra. And when we arrive to our crown chakra, we just merge those energies together and those qualities together of Mother Earth and of the highest sources. And it becomes to be one energy, very deep, very strong. Tiskri Nam, Alat Sinor, Bena Lev Shalanu. Wait, we didn't arrive. We didn't arrive at it. All right. Wait. And one more thing. I'm not in my regular situation. 
the energy is so strong that I have to 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 learn how to hold it, how to contain it. It's not a regular energy, it's something which is very strong for me. So I have to be very um, listen to the beat that they give it. Okay. And I and we give this energy to fulfill us. And this energy is different than it was until now. Here it happens once again what happened on Thursday. The energy is a golden energy which mixed with the love of the infinite love of the Most High God and Goddess. And this energy is very gentle and very strong at the same time. And this energy just creates a field from our soul chakra, star soul chakra. Above our head. Hmm? Which is above our head. Mm -hmm. To our zero chakra or ground star chakra. And Be below our feet. Yes. And it contains all of our bodies into this field. And the energy into this field starts to vibrate. First of all, wow. First of all, it vibrates a little slowly, but it becomes stronger and stronger, higher and higher, quicker and quicker until the vibration into this field becomes to be so high that we can hear the sound of the vibration. Mm. And now we connect also our cosmic chakra to the opposite cosmic chakra above in below us below us and we create a huge field every one of us wow and this huge field just contains huge energy very strong uh -huh. that starts it's like starts to to take apart us and to rebuild us in a different way it's just like it starts to build our DNA our seed into the seeds into the cells our atoms our molecules in a new way which is lighter than the molecules and the atoms that creates our physical body right now and it's like that we are passing now. How did you say? Peruk. A taking apart. A taking uh, apart of all our cells, DNA, molecules, bodies, fields, and rebuilt. And we will just give this process to happen and now I will start to pass 
télépathiquement. The signals, the signs, the symbols, the frequencies, the oui. geometric structures, the codes, the photons, with the very deep knowledge that passes through me now. to explain something those codes and symbols and frequencies and geometric structures and also sounds and colors that in our physical eyes and ears we cannot notice in because they are above and below our limited sight and hearing. Oh. They are creating at the womb of God, of the Most High God. I, uh... And in the same, at the same time, they also create in our unlimited possibilities field. We will just let it be. Yeah. And I do not describe and I do not sing and I do not draw it because everything of this action will limit those energies those creations they are. and will bring them to a very very narrow patterns So we just give it to happen. Of course, every one of us that agrees and chooses it to happen. And we can say to our bodies, I agree. I agree and I give this process to happen into me. I agree that I am deserved to this process. I agree that I am deserved to be who am I fully? I deserve to accept. I deserve to, to grow. I agree. I give it to happen right now.
And of course, not everything happens for our best. Also individualistic of everyone, each one of us. And at the same time for all humanity. For all the parts that wants, that would like to accept and to join this process in humanity. And I will just describe. It comes to us as a ball of light, a little ball of light that starts to vibrate. Into this ball of light, there is all the potential of all of those symbols, qualities, frequencies. And when this little ball starts to vibrate, it creates a vibration that creates gradually another ball of light that contains the same qualities. And now they vibrate together. And slowly they attract more photons, more energy to build more and more light balls that creates a kind of a pattern that this pattern vibrates and start to create all of the presence, all of the qualities, all of the core that it has inside. And the beautiful thing is that Meanwhile, it seems to be like human being, which means it seems to be like cells of human being that co-opt together, they gathered together to create structures, different structures that every one of them creates a new vibration, creates a new energy. and the new creation and we will just give it to happen and when it happens also in our etherical body it becomes to be a little different it becomes to be a little more like constellation of stars in the structure Cause and we will just let it happen. And if in every one of our bodies, subtle bodies, those frequencies suit themselves to the frequency, unique frequency of the same body, which means that the frequency of the emotional body is different from the frequency of the soul body. So all the vibrations stars, photons, symbols, sounds, sights, geometrical 
structures that enters they stay in the most high level of creation and of frequencies but they also at the same time suit themselves to the field that they are going to create into And there is one more thing that we are asked to declare, declare the lots here? Yes. I am ready to be human. Ah. I agree to be human. I agree to be all of who I am in my wholeness. I am ready to be present, presence in all of what I have and in all of what I am. And we will give this light, which is very clear, very shine, very strong, very pure, to fulfill us with all of what it contains. Ah. And we will agree to separate from the old patterns, from the old vibrations, from the old structures, and to rebuild from a new a new one, different ones, which much higher, which are much more suit to our continuation, which have the opportunity and the part to prepare us to the next step of the humanity evolution. And we will 
will just let it happen now. Dear God. And we will ask now that those energies, vibrations, photons, codes, symbols, signs, lights, voices, sounds, geometrical fields and structures will start to create in our individualistic unlimited possibilities field the ways the tools that we need to create ourselves to manifest ourselves in our destiny on earth which means goal uh, purpose. And our purpose on earth. In the part that we got, every one of us, in this period to bring and to manifest on earth. We will ask to create the ways and the tools that can let us bring the energy from her higher sources to realization, to manifestation on the material level, on the practical level, on the physical level, to let it be manifested, to let it be exist. And we will ask also, also the manifesting of us as human beings, as men, as women, as person, in every part, in every level. in every subject. And the light that enters to us is so bright and strong. That we becomes to be like a crystal suns. Ask this crystal shining into us to take apart all the things that still has to be broke, broken, has to be released and live. And we will ask this shining light to cure, to heal every part that still needs parts and that still needs healing and cure and transformation to what we become to be. Uh. 
I uh, tell you, huh? And we will just agree and just let it happen. Ask to create a Merkava around this field of cosmic chakras and another Merkava around the first one. And we will let those two Merkavot work together when what they do is to take the energy and to make it more physical, more realistic. I tell uh, tell. And will we let those Merkavot works together now, work together now, and take all the processes that we are passing through now into us and around us, and they will make, and they are making the synchronization between the two things. And between all and among all the processes that we are passing through right now. But, but, it's, like, check it. but it's like we it takes all the energy and makes the synchronization and the integration among all the parts to become to a huge one thing full and whole and it doesn't mean that all of our bodies and fields vibrate at the same vibration no oh. because every part of us has its own unique vibration but they're all in harmony. They're all in frequency and in fluently. And we will just let it be now. And also to become more and more material, more and more physical, until we ground it into the earth, those energies. We will let this process to continue a little more. Ah. We will ask to feel the revival that we are receiving now. from the movement of those new vibrations, new protons, new photons, new molecules, new atoms that built us. And we have to understand, it's not only the, that the atoms it itself changed their structure into the molecule, it's not that the molecule itself only changed her structure. It's that the atom itself changed deeply. He 
his essence. So the structure of the atom itself changed. It became the transformed to a new one, to a new energy, to a new fields, to new vibrations, to a new creation. Every one of the atoms that build us. At the most little point everywhere in our fields. And slowly, slowly, we will ask our two Merkavot to balance all those vibrations, all of this action of new light, of new molecules, new atoms, new symbols, photons, structures, I, uh, and patterns in all of our fields. And we will ask to take all the things that have been created now in our unlimited possibility fields, also the individualistic and also the collective of all human beings, all of humanity, will become more and more realistic, mukshan. Uh, realized. Realized. It just, it creates from the Ruach, from the spirit to the material. It's like it just born from the spirit to the material. It just... Wow, can I explain it? Suddenly, there is a structures that starts to rebuild. And those structures holds into themselves all the vibrations, the energies, the signals, the signs, the symbols, the sounds, the vibrations, the photons, the codes, and bring it to be something which is much more focused and much more can be used. I uh, tell. And we will ask slowly, slowly, all the activity to become more and more gentle, to decrease the powerful energy more and more, ah. to let this energy and vibrations absorb into all of our fields and all of our being. Uh. The same in our individualistic field and collective field of humanity at the same time. And from moment to moment, we will ask that those energy, energies will suit themselves once again to the fields that we need to have on the 
two dimensional on earth, two dimension on earth. And that our bodies and our all of our parts with all the new things that we got and are still working in us and will continue to work into us will suit themselves to the abilities and to the manifesting of the physical bodies and the gentle bodies on this earth. And we will see that, I don't want to, to say it in English, it's like that there is a structure, only the pattern stays and all the enter is absorbed. All the what? It's like that there are lines, only the lines of the structure are exists and all the must be flame and everything that's Excuse inside me. them it's absorbed in into us okay so what stays is that from the fields that we had like diamonds of gold only the structure of the pattern stays and all of the energy of the gold of the vibrations absorb into us in suiting to the vibration that we can hold when we are on the third dimension on our everyday life. And it continues to work, but in hatama, uh, in suiting to what we can hold and what we can use. Okay. And it continues to develop us, it continues to build us from inner side to outside, more and more. And now we will ask that if there are energies which are too strong for us, or for that moment, not suit, that they will disappear, and all the rest will absorb into us, and continue the work, and now I ask that all the bodies will merge once again with all the bodies that are exist on the third dimensional. I will yeah, say it in, in, in Hebrew. What? I will say it in Hebrew. Okay. okay. שבהם היינו חוזרים כעת אל הכאן ואל העכשיו בקלות ובפשטות ומתמזגים בקלות הגוף הפיזי עם הפיזי, האתרי עם האתרי, הרגשי עם הרגשי, השכלי עם השכלי והנשמתי עם הנשמתי והנשמה עם הנשמה. תודה, זה נעשה, זה נעשה, זה נעשה. בורא כל שישנו ובורא כל שישנו, הרי זה מצווה שהמרכבות ממשיכות בעבודתן עד שהן יוצרות אינטגרציה מלאה בין כל החלקים וכל האנרגיות וכל הרטטים שבכל השדות שלנו ובכל הגופים שלנו. והרי זה מצווה שכאשר המרכבות האלה מסיימות את תפקידן, הן נטמעות בתוכנו או משתחררות בהתאם לבחירה החופשית של כל אחד ואחת מאיתנו. והרי זה מצווה שמרכבות אלה ממשיכות לעבוד עד שהן מסיימות את תפקידן. תודה, זה נעשה, זה נעשה, זה נעשה. בורא כל שישנו, בורא כל שישנו. הרי זה מצווה שכל התהליכים שעברנו בכל הממדים, בכל השדות, בכל המרחבים ובכל האיש, באים ויבואו לידי ביטוי מלא באינטגרציה מלאה בחיי היומיום שלנו. בהדרגתיות, בהתאם ליכולת ההכלה המתפתחת והגדלה והמתעצמת שלנו, בהתאם לטובתנו העליונה, ובהתאם לתוכנית העליונה, האלוהית העליונה עבורנו, הן בתור אינדיבידואלי והן בתור האנושות הקולקטיבית. תודה, זה נעשה, זה נעשה, זה נעשה. בורא כל שישנו, ובורא כל שישנו, הרי זה מצווה שכעת... הנשמה שלנו חוזרת במלואה 
לכאן ולעכשיו בפשטות ובקלות. תודה, זה נעשה, זה נעשה, זה נעשה. אני שולחת כעת פירמידה ירוקה משפת האור 2. אני שולחת עכשיו פירמידה ירוקה של שפת האור כדי להביא את התהליך מהכוח אל הפועל. exist, to become realized on earth, on Mother Earth, on the third dimension. And now I invite everyone to remember that our feet are Hi, still... Hi. Hi. Hi, sweetheart. Hi. We are still in the heart of Mother Earth and to, ob- to observe and to once again inhale the qualities of grounding, security, base, roots, stability, presence, ah. and realization. We can also add, if we would like to, nurturing and support. Also, receiving and containing. And once again, We inhale it from the feet into Mother Earth and we spread it to all of our subtle bodies gradually as we did it before. We bring up our energetic legs and we merge them into our physical legs. Yes, and, and not only the physical but all of our subtle bodies and our soul and we do it gradually as exactly we did it before. And we bring it gradually until our crown chakra. And when we arrive to our crown chakra, we inhale our uh, energetic legs from the heart of Mother Earth back to our physical body. And when we exhale, we just give the energy to spread it to fulfill all of our bodies. And we do the same with the energetic that we accepted from high, we inhale it inside us to our heart and exhale it to all of our bodies. And please, beloved ones, remember, what we did today was very strong. Yes. So remember to drink, remember to eat, and remember to lanoach, to rest. Yes. And, and friends, I just want to explain. All that Noam was saying in Hebrew towards the end, it was basically her, her prayer that all the processes and everything that happened today would be for our highest good and for the highest good of the world. That was the essence yes. of everything that she said in Hebrew. And in addition to that, that everything will come true in realization in our three-dimensional world, all the processes. That At the did. right timing. Yes. Gradually, according to our ability to... Um, to to contain, our ability to contain to and contain. to receive and to use those energies and for, those processes. For the highest good. Yes. Of all concern. Thank you very much, Noam. Thank you very much and thank you all for being with us and A lot of love and a good continuation to everyone. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye, thank you.